want to show you a day in the life of a digital nomad, but through this, the lifestyle of each one of us is completely different. This is Steve. This is my office. There's probably about 15 people working here. We pay $110 US here for the month. The reason why I like working here is because I can make a lot of phone calls. I can't do that as much in a cafe. I was an account manager for an engineering recruiting firm. I was starting side gigs when I'd come home from work and found that you know there were some opportunities within e-commerce that I read about and took some courses. Started writing ebooks and selling them on Amazon. I grew up in a family of all funeral directors and I saw a lot of death of people of all ages so it made me always have a different perspective on life of wanting to go after what I want. And there's digital nomads who work from like coffee shops or restaurants like Mike. Hey, what's up? I just don't like being stuck inside all day. It's interesting to get out. You can meet so many different people when you're working at different restaurants and cafes. Normally I wake up every day 7 a.m. I'm at the coffee shop at about 7.30. Then typically I'll work until about 10 o'clock, hit the gym, come back after lunch, refocused, ready to accomplish my big goals for the day. For me, being at, stuck at home in Connecticut during the winter when it's freezing and miserable was not my idea of happiness. So now I'm down here in a beach paradise in Playa del Carmen, going to check out a new city next month and then just keep traveling after that. Some digital nomads like moving from city to city, but in their daily life, they like a little bit more peace and quiet, like Rob. Usually I work from home because a lot of the cafes have kind of spotty Wi-Fi. And one of the important things that I need to stay focused is a solid internet connection. My living expense is pretty much cut in half. I don't have to pay for gas in a car anymore. Groceries are usually cheaper in other places I travel around the world, like Mexico for example where I am now. I like doing three months at a time because it's a long enough period of time where I get to experience the full location, but it's also short enough where I can get like three or four different locations within the same year. Now that I work for myself, I pretty much just have as much freedom to live my life the way that I want to. Those three guys you just met are not only digital nomads, but they're also best friends, roommates, and business partners. We actually run a marketing company for brands and manufacturers on e-commerce marketplaces. We help them grow their sales. What did you think of that? We all quit our jobs and went for it. The least favorite part about working with them? I don't really have a least favorite part. This is like what we do is awesome. Like there's no least favorite part. <laughs> this overdose in travel was from Playa del Carmen. Next one, who knows? <laughs>